Up against one of the top scorers in the country, John Crosby. He can fill it up for Delaware State. Hokies will head to Maui on Friday. Three, 200 pounds. He spent three years at Dayton. 32 points against Long Island University two days ago, and John Crosby has the first two points of the night. Pieces in year number two for Eric Scooters. But John Crosby, he has been legit against all four opponents. And a great pass from Crosby. It sets up the second field goal. Ima Lee misses his first three-point attempt, and Crosby snags the board. He can shoot it. Crosby, the Dayton transfer, makes it 7 to nothing. Delaware State. Be fairly patient in the half court. John Crosby had 17 points in the first 13 minutes against Long Island on Monday. Another early lead for Delaware State, but they cannot guard P.J. Horn. All of last year already has eight this season in the first five games. John Crosby dribbles it off of his left foot. Off and running, Ali. Oh, what a sweet slash and the finish. Give him a free throw. Started with the turnover on the other end. Good job, defense. The escape save with the misfire from inside by Pete Green. What great vision by Wabisa Beatty. Five early points by Horn. The successful start for this Hokie basketball team. Two-man game between Beatty and Couture. Seven threes the last two games for Couture. Make it eight and a nice kiss off the window for the birthday boy. John Ogiaco, the moment is now. He is in at the five spot for Virginia Tech. Crosby, 26 feet out. He connects eight early points for John Crosby. Baltimore and all the way up to New York, and Eric Skeeters is going to do a good job there. He's got good players coming, and uh, we'll do a good job with that program. On to take the title again. Last second loss at home. Sky is the limit for this program, and certainly the case for Landers Nolly the second. He has his first two of the night. 10 of the 12 for Delaware State coming for the veteran from Baltimore. Jalen Cohn, he's been on fire in the last three games. Bottoms up, Jalen Cohn. He's got the ball in his hands as a point guard, but he can really score the basketball, but not resent it because of how hard he plays and how unselfish he is. John Crosby averaging 24 points per game the last three. All five on the floor for Delaware State. What does this mean for Landers Nolly the second? Backdoor layups. Great challenge by Radford in the corner. Virginia Tech, they've got Couture all alone for his second three of the first half. Eight early points for Hunter Couture. Before the defense gets set or after the ball has gone in the lane and come back out. That's a perfect example of a, of a coaching staff taking advantage of their talents. This is Wabisa Beatty's game. Radford all alone, easiest shot of the season for Tyrese Radford and Beattie collecting another dime. For an incredible rebounder. He will force that transition bounce pass and Miles Carter, Jr. from Philly, he gets the steal, sets the stage for a layup and one finish, LJ Stansberry, five straight. Wide open look in the first half. Amir Bennett will give it back to Beattie. Wilkins, he is due for three. Drive by Miles Carter. He's averaging five a game, a little long on the jumper. And now he Malim, he has the rebound. Wilkins, his second straight three. Keep shooting the basketball. Sophomore from Winston-Salem. Big start to open the season against Clemson. He's been coming in off the bench. He's a little short. Offensive rebound, P.J. Horn. Wilkins, back door, and Horn slashes and finishes. He misses. It's Jalen Cohn with an offensive rebound. Smallest guy on the floor can rebound to basketball. Ojiako, get out of my way. Long, athletic, and knows how to play. Crosby deed up by Naheem Aleem. He forces the miss. Cohn has been on fire the last two games, and he cashes home on a corner three. Points for Couture. Crosby is out of the game for Delaware State. What a sweet find, and Bennett, a left-handed layup. Learn when to take those opportunities, but you gotta love the way he rebounds, helps on defense, and runs the floor. A no hesitation three by Lansing the third. It's his seventh three of the season. Well, Iowa Community College kids on this roster for second year coach Eric Skeeters. Wilkins, the double tap, and it's Radford. Third time's a charm. Gets it back, gets it back. 
Aline, corner three, give it to him. 15 first half points for Delaware State. He's got the ball with the clock under five. Hornets in trouble, and their final shot of the half gets blocked out of the building. John Ogiaco, his fourth block in the last four games. After making a couple early threes, Wilkins off the mark to start half number two. Eight first half threes for Virginia Tech. Left Bennett wide open on the block. Radford, the sweet slash, went for the reverse against three defenders, and he still ends up with the offensive rebound. Why not for Wilkins? He'll guard your best defender. He'll go after every loose ball, and you don't need to call a play for him. Landers, Nolly. Strong defense, but patient post play by Omari Pete Green. And they went straight after Nolly down on a post up as soon as he entered the game. Little shuffle cut, post up. Naheem Aleen lives for the corner threes. He is king of the corner. Bennett expanding his game from 20 feet out. One long stride and dribble. Stansberry loses it. Radford on the run. Draws four defenders. Beatty, you've got to shoot this, and he will. And come up with his first three of the night. Three points, four rebounds, seven assists. Just another nine in Wabisa Beatty's world. And again, penetrate to the logo and then find an open shooter. It's a freshman, average 42 points in high school, so you know he believes that thing's going to win when he lets it go. Landers, Nolly the second, finally free, and he cashes in on his first three of the night. Beatty is so tough on these screens. He'll give Nolly the switch, but now it's under five. Bennett, big second half for him. The open shot or put it on the floor and get to the rim, and he's done both in the last three possessions. Quiet in the first half, only four points. He's got seven in the second half, and Nolly has six in the first five minutes of half number two. That was the first miss in four attempts this season from the free throw line for Ogiaco. Delaware State struggling from beyond the arc after a hot start. And Naheem Ali, what a sweet move. Jalen Cohen locked in defensively. A oh, great defense by Wilkins. But a fortunate finish with Ogiaco challenging at the rim. 50 to play, 22-point lead. You fly to Maui on Friday, flight to L.A. and, and a flight to the islands. Jalen Cohn taking flight and rattling home a quarter three. And a flat-footed rebound for Landers. Nolly the second behind the back. No look. Naheem Aline clean with the corner three. Landers Nolly could have taken that all the way to the rim. Instead, he gave it to... He gave it to the shooter in the corner, wide open. And finally, Pinky Wiley. He hold him down all the time. He's got too many skills. Double figures in all five games. And now Pinky Wiley comfortable from the corner. Back-to-back -back threes for him and a timeout for Eric Skeeters. Fifteen threes, a season high for Virginia Tech. Cohn going inside with eight this evening. He had six offensive rebounds on Saturday. We Same story, different night. Traditional double-double out of him, <laughs> nine and eight right now. CC, Virginia Tech 15 out of 29 on threes tonight. That's the eighth turnover of the game for Virginia Tech, their first of the second half. He hasn't scored in the last... 25 minutes after getting 15 points early. No look to Wilkins, reverse to Cone. Fourth three of the game for Jalen Cone. And it's Couture's turn. He misses the three. 16 of 32 threes have fallen for Virginia Tech, and they continue to crash the glass. Second chance for Cone. Give it to him. We've got plenty of time left, partner. Jalen Cone getting about two points per minute, and there's the second turnover of the second half for Virginia Tech. Pinky Wiley has the last eight points for Delaware State. Really good defender. He played behind Kenny Williams at high school at L.C. Bird. And now he is a spectator to another slam by John Ogiaco. Hokies had 18 threes against Central Connecticut State last year. They have 17 tonight. Naheem Aleem, number 18. And it shouldn't be surprising that a Mike Young team will break the record. 325 threes at Wofford last year. Their offense is so three-point centric. Clutch situations. And that list certainly grew some here tonight. 
Ojiako, the jump hook and one. John Ojiako. Do you like his length and athleticism? But you also have to. Crosby fails to connect, and Virginia Tech ready for the record breaker. Wilkins, a new program record, 19 three-pointers for Virginia Tech. Isaiah Wilkins, he hits two in the first four games, four for six tonight. And with two minutes to play, no need to hesitate if you're Delaware State. Omari Pete Green. The freshman movement, it's alive and well in Blacksburg. Naheem Aleem at number 20. One minute to play. One minute to play. Bennett, great feed, great find, and a layup inside. The turnover, third of the second half for Virginia Tech. One more three is offered and missed by Crosby, and this is the final possession for Virginia Tech. Wilkins, you know he's going to shoot it 100. Early in the season. One more shot inside for Crosby. It's contested by Naheem Aline, and that'll do it. It's a 5-0 start for Virginia Tech.